iPhone, film camera, it doesn't matter what you got. We're gonna show you in today's video the best photo spots in Wateroon. Let's go. What's going on guys? Welcome to a brand new video today. So I just dropped my parents off. Uh, we're at a staycation out in Lee Meridian, Bangkok. We've had an amazing experience though overall Lee Meridian. Uh, they had creative hour last night, which is something that they do uh, between certain hours, which is free drinks, free food. Absolutely love the vibes out here and the breakfast, as Rachel said, it was amazing. Uh, but right now we're gonna get to the room, show you the room real quick, and then we're gonna get to Wataroon and show you where the, some of the best photo spots are. All right guys, so we made it to the room real fast. But this is the bathroom right when you walk in. We got a tub, shower, toilets. It's very spacious, which we love. And uh, the bed is super comfortable. So this is the king size bed. It was a lot cleaner yesterday, so I'll put the B-roll on top of it. I love the amount of space that we have, the television and the couch. And we got a view of Mahanakan, which is incredible. Now my parents, uh, they don't have a king bed. They actually have two twin beds in the other room. And as I mentioned, besides the beds, it's identical. Uh, but besides showing you guys all around Lee Meridian, this is one of our favorite staycations in Bangkok that we've stayed at so far. Uh, again, the purpose of this video, which everyone voted for, is to show you the best photo spots at Wataroon. So we're gonna get out of here. My parents will be done in the massage in about an hour, and we'll get to Wataroon, and we'll, guys, we'll hunt down these photo spots. All right guys, so after a quick grab taxi ride, we made it out to Wat Arun. This is one of Bangkok's top touristic attractions, especially as a temple. And uh, typically the best time to come out here is in the early mornings. Right now it is around 1, 2 p.m. Uh, but we're gonna find four or five of the best shots. Hopefully we can find some good photos out here at Wat Arun. Uh, we're gonna walk around and observe all the shots that we can find on the outer layer of Wataroon. This is like the outer part. Everywhere is pretty picturesque. You can see people getting their shots. And then we're gonna go inwards and try to find some better shots, hopefully more shots too. So I think we officially found the first shot. So the entrance is right over there, at least one of the entrances. Again, this is the outer layer. Then you have this row of trees, but right when you come to around this area, you can just kind of frame it and it is super beautiful because you can see like three or four pillars. You can see four stairwells. Um, I'm even thinking about using this tree maybe as the framing, as you can see. We'll keep you guys posted. Maybe, I think this will be the first shot. Let's see. So guys, I think we got the shot. So the first shot, I believe is right behind this tree right over here. You have kind of the shrubs in the angle or you don't need to use it. Uh, it's kind of a, a, I use it as a tight shot. I think I had it shoot it as 35, um, but it was just aiming that way with Rachel up the stairs. Beautiful shot, but there's another shot also. The second shot, you're just framing it. You can just see the layers of water rune in the background is just super beautiful. And it's a tighter shot, I'm gonna focus on her, the stairs. Um, a tip where this spot is at for the first one or two spots, you could say, is this like little souvenir shop. So there's a door right over here, a gate that opens up to souvenirs, like t-shirts, everything. And then it opens up to water rune. So this is the first spot right by this tree, right behind this tree where someone stands on the stairs. And then right over here, focus at a, a 35, I'd say, more like right around here with your object right over here. I thought those two shots were beautiful. I like the first one that Rachel pointed out. I like the tighter shot that I got uh, or I found as the second spot. I think we're gonna head into more of the temple. Uh, there's tons of people shooting and hopefully we can find some better spot shots. So before we walk in, I think we already found the next shot. Um, it's still on the outer parts. It's just, we're literally there for the first two shots. It's at the very end. So there's actually a monk right over there. You can see the end gate. But the shot is where the tripod's at. So I'm gonna be standing right over here. You're gonna be framing the camera right around there, getting the full arch angle here. The object can be right framed between the pillars right over here. And hopefully we get the second, fourth, technically third shot of this video right over here. So I'm pretty sure we got the shot. We had to wait patiently, obviously, because people kept passing uh, from the back part. Uh, and if you can edit people out, that's great. I'm trying to make this video as much for beginners as possible. Right now, we're gonna go into the temple more and find hopefully the next uh, shot or two. I'm gonna see how Ali's doing too. 
one more thing, I just got the last shot on my iPhone also, so you can compare it between iPhone and the Canon R6. Um, you can get a good shot even with the phone, so you don't need to have a fancy camera. I found a beautiful shot with the iPhone. Uh, now Rachel's actually with Ollie, that's why Ollie's chill. I got my tripod with me, so this is something that I couldn't do in the Taj Mahal, and uh, this has been one of my best travel partners and help me get photos. I'm gonna to try to find the next shot uh, where you could use a tripod. Unlike the Taj Mahal, you could bring a tripod here to Wadaroon. Guys, we got the next shot. This is the third or fourth shot. And I didn't use the tripod, surprisingly. <laughs> so, Right when you walk on in, you if you have a wide enough lens, you could use uh, either your iPhone in 0.5 or you have, I have a 15, so it was shot in 15. Uh, you can frame the entire Wadaru in the temple uh, and just get the entire shot frame with the object right in the middle. Beautiful shot, so the object's right there, full framing. You can also get portrait shots with the backdrop right over here, which we did. We got some shots with Mommy and Ollie. Overall, this place is super picturesque. It's super easy to get shots. This is like the fourth or fifth shot already. Uh, we're gonna walk around, hopefully find a couple more. This place is so beautiful. All right, guys, got the shot. I was standing right up there. Rachel was standing right up there, framed the two brown structures. Now we're down here. Everyone's shooting supposedly over here, but it's pretty similar to the other side. And uh, I think we're gonna try to frame up another shot right over here with the stairs and see what we can get out of this. We've been waiting forever for this last shot. Sometimes you just have to wait. I don't know if this is the last shot, but we've been very patient. <laughs> Good, babe. Two shots. One right here, and one right behind me. So everyone will stand down here and scale, but if you go up, you can actually get the full, full top. You can get all the patterns in the shot. Uh, kind of like a portrait shot, so I think I shot it in 35, uh, angling it up right at the very, very bottom part while Rachel was standing right at the second level. And uh, yeah, I got two shots here. All right, we're gonna give you guys a consolation shot that Rachel just found down at the same level where the previous two shots were. So instead of aiming it this way, you're saying that the framing on this side is pretty good. This will be the last shot I'll give you guys to end the video. I'm gonna frame it up, I'm gonna shoot it. There's so many people coming and I'll just shoot it real quick, edit it, maybe I'll take them out. It's really difficult finding these shots, especially with the amount of tourists here. Again, this is like 2 p.m. If you come in the early, early morning, there'll definitely be a lot less people. Uh, we're gonna shoot a little more. We're gonna walk around a little more and get some more B-roll. If you guys get out to Bangkok, also check out Lee Meridian. The food has been incredible. I'm looking forward to the barbecue tonight. And uh, I hope you guys, again, enjoyed this quick video out here at Wadaroon, showing you guys some of the best photo spots. Uh, around. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys hit the subscribe button. Hit the like also if you guys enjoyed this video. This is the second time that I made a video like this. Comment down below your thoughts and hit that notification bell so you guys are notified for the next ones coming out and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye guys.